All right, guys, here we go. Florida Biomed Society. We're going to do a walkthrough of the vendor hall and show you what this event is really like. So you're standing in the main corridor, which actually goes quite a ways. You would not understand the amount of walking it takes to get to this point because this is a huge conference center. And down here are all the classrooms. And the ballroom ahead, the following three or four doors on the right, these are all the vendor hall. So let's go ahead and take a look and see what the vendor hall is like this year. I have never seen a biomed society that is this well organized. And here's the main entrance. Let's do this, guys. Okay, so, so that you can see the gravity of the situation. Take a look at how big this room is. This room is actually pretty large considering it's a biomed society. This is how well organized Florida is. I love this, guys. So, I see you. I see hey, you. man, what's going on? Oh, uh, there's Paul from Regal. Okay, here's Provo. So let's go ahead and say hi to the guys at Provo. I think we're going to head down the left. Hey, man, how's it going? So, here we're going to start with Provo. We're going to go down the left side. Hey, sir. So here's Rigel, there's the guys. They actually got a pretty nice booth. Check that out. Let's take a look at some of their offerings. They actually have a full setup here. Okay, we got Phoenix Data Systems. The CMS, CMMS, <laughs> Gale Medical, hello, okay, so we're going to go ahead and go section by section, Phillips Medical, hey guys, you can see that their display, and Phillips is all, always top notch, you guys know that, oh wow, how cool is that? I have not seen that early view before. That is so cool. No kidding. How long has that been out? Really? I haven't been in a Phillips hospital since South Carolina, and that's been, a, that's been several years. So uh, very excited. Uh, well, I'll talk about that a little bit more later because uh, I, I talk about medical technology and whatnot. So. Uh, Every time I see something I haven't seen before, I gotta stop and check it out, man. That looks very cool. Okay. All right. Here's Intermed. What's up, man? What's going on, Justin? How you doing today, I'm doing sir? Doing good. Really good, guys. This is the Intermed group. You guys still have positions open? We do have positions open. Oh, uh, we, we have a concentration of positions open in the Dallas area, okay. and we also have some positions in Batesville, Arkansas, uh, uh, Salisbury, Maryland, okay. and some positions in the Florida area as well. Oh, excellent. Okay. Well, guys, if anything, I'll get you guys a list of their positions, and we can uh, Perfect. definitely go over that because uh, I want to see you guys get the best opportunities, all right? Okay. <laughs> and you can see these guys. Who are, who are these goofballs? <laughs> Here's Phoebe Medical. There you can see, it's my boss, Keith. And actually, guys, we will do a whole separate video on this because there's something that you guys should see. Now, I did not know that there's a variety of sources that you can find oxygen sensors for other than OEM. And I found you guys an excellent source for O2 cells 
And they also have a very interesting O2 monitor right there. You can see it on the right hand side. Now this one is typical of what we would see, but that one is a cool offering. So we'll go over that in a whole separate video because I think it's a cool tech. It deserves its own video. Hey sir, how you doing? Day trend. All right guys, now this is one of those things I haven't had enough time to get good coverage for, but day trend has got some cool stuff too. So check out all their stuff. Day trend puts their stuff in ruggedized cases. And if I can say that, you know, for a traveling tech, Daytran stuff is pretty rugged. I, I do dig it. Uh, I haven't had too much experience with it, but I like anything that's difficult to break, okay? So that's this little section over here. So let's keep going past the Phillips. All right. How are you doing, sir? Hello there. So you guys do equipment liquidation, right? Yes, we do. We do a little bit more than just liquidation. We introduce a structured process for equipment retirement planning. Okay. So it's a little bit more of a robust solution. We just opened up an office, a warehouse there in Florida, about outside of Fort Myers. Excellent. And do you have a business card that I can... Uh, I do. Can you flip that over for me on the... On the sure, can. Thank you. How about that? I appreciate it. All right, guys, take a look. Equipment liquidation. Some of you guys never know what to do with your used medical equipment. Check these guys out, all right? Now in Florida. Now in Florida. Now in Florida, right, right in Fort Myers. Well, this is my first time in Florida as a biomed, so I, I'm, I'm meeting new people and seeing new things, man. Well, welcome. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Argo. Hey. What's, what's up, up guys? Jason, how, you doing? how you doing? Oh, my gosh. Better biomed. So, Argo has supported me for a long time, and I do appreciate that. And it's, it's actually interesting to see everybody came out for this show, and I, I absolutely love it, man. So Argo, here, let me, let me capture you guys' uh, card. Sure. So Argo offers a variety of services, and they probably should get their own video for, for all the stuff that they do. Because Shoot, I could, right? Sure. I, I could not do it justice to do it uh, <laughs> in this little clip. That's very cool. Sorry, we'll work together soon to get our yes. own video. Well, right? guys, there's there's some stuff that I'm I'm gonna I can't really talk about it, but uh, by April we're gonna release some stuff that's gonna be very cool, awesome. and I'm gonna be looking for help in certain regions that I currently can't support. So I, well, I definitely, know you're from Michigan, so yeah, yeah, that's you know, true. Keep it in the family in there, Justin. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's true. Yeah. So these yeah. guys are in the Midwest. You, All right, guys, See I'll you, talk bye. to you later. Imaging Solutions. Of course. Hey guys, how y'all doing? How are you? Let's see. Oh, how are we gonna do this? I think I'm gonna have to go back through this section. How are you doing, sir? Doing great. How are you? I'm I'm doing pretty good. Pretty good. It's been a good show so far. It's great it's been excellent. Show. I've never been to one from Florida, so interesting. Richardson Electronics. Headstat. <laughs> do a variety of services. So here's something that you guys should see. Is in the middle of the hall. We have food that's going to be rolled out. You can see how massive this hall really is. It's really big. And of course, the guys at Prom. Oh, the guys at Prom always have some cool stuff, man. Still, they always have some cool stuff. <laughs> <laughs> how y'all doing, man? Good, hey, how about you? Oh, I'm, I'm loving the show, man. This is probably one of my favorites. Uh, you know, and I've been to a quite a few. Uh, you just I'm, keep coming to it. This is an excellent venue, and I'm very surprised at the amount of support and turnout from Florida Biomeds. I'm very surprised. We've been coming for like 16 years. Really? No kidding. Well, I, I'm looking forward to next year's, and uh, maybe I'll do a speak or something at the next one. We'll, we'll see how this year goes, but uh, it's going to be good times. We got Sage Services. Now, I've worked with Sage before, uh, back in South Carolina, uh, Mount Pleasant, South Carolina. How you guys doing? 
and uh, Sage offers cables, and uh, now they're getting into extra services and stuff. But uh, I have used Sage products for probably close to 10 years. It's been a while. So. Spectrum Technologies, they're a equipment calibrator. How are you doing, sir? Thank you. Try Imaging. I'm very surprised uh, that I'm not seeing Try Imaging. Ozark, Ozark Biomedical. If you guys don't know, Ozark are the guys, they provide a lot of parts for centrifuges. They're, they're my go-to people when I need centrifuge parts, all right? So that's Ozark Biomedical. Always a good resource. Let's see. If you guys need, if you guys need info from Ozark, there you go. This is business card. Good people, man. I always get excellent support. How you doing, sir? Yeah, I think I'm gonna make it. <laughs> Here, you're sober. Okay. Oh, Stop yeah. That. Oh, man. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, I won't be able to hold the camera, you guys. Okay. So, let's see. Go for medical. They sell medical equipment. Excellent. You guys, uh, Southeast Biomedical, you know I just uh, did a thing on them for being in Tech Nation magazine. And of course, one of my favorite vendors of all time, the guys at Fluke. How y'all doing? <laughs> hey, Mark. So Fluke obviously sets the standard when it comes to cool stuff. And every time I come to a show, I always see exceptional stuff at their booth. And I never get to play with the toys, not very much anymore, but soon I'm gonna do more Fluke videos, guys, I promise. I absolutely promise. So here, let's come on over here. <laughs> Atlas Specialty Lighting, holy cow. I could spend all day talking about uh, lights, guys. You guys know I love lights. So Atlas Specialty Lighting. A variety of built bulbs for xenon light sources, etc. Multi medical solutions. Multi medical, uh, they offer a variety of services. Hi, how you doing? I'm doing very well. Oh, injectors, you guys know. Injectors can give you problems. Here we got 626. How y'all doing? I'm doing really good, really good. <laughs> the medical equipment doctor, there he is himself. There he is. I always love the, the caricature that he does right here. You can see medical equipment doctor. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> All right. Advanced ultrasound. All right. There we go. How you doing? Advanced ultrasound systems. Now I'm back. All right. Hope you guys are keeping track because uh, this place is so big that I might get lost. Okay. Oh, that's cool. There's a single use flexible bronchoscope. That's very cool. Maybe I'll do a video on that in the future. Very cool. Very cool. Hey. <laughs> you see some of the stuff at their booth? So here's some of the cool stuff you can see. You can see the bronchoscope right there, how they would use it. And it's with one of the newer uh, glide scope systems right here. Very cool. Glide scope is one of those technologies that they're always innovating. And I always love that, man. You can see the glide scope right there. Flexible bronchoscope. 
Oh man, I'll run out of footage if I can. <laughs> no, it's very cool though. Single use Bronx scope. I yeah. love it. You can use it to intimate, you can use it to bronc, all kinds of stuff. Look at this. I love that it's on a, a tall part because in surgical environments, that's exactly what it is. Check it out, you get a side by side view. Alright, let's take a look. Now, this is normally a two man job. Let's see if I can handle it. Introducing the scope. Uh -oh. There we go, there we go. So now you can there see straight down there. And you can use it to intubate that way. Interesting. That's very cool. Well, thank you very much for the quick demo. <laughs> That's very cool. I, I love seeing. I love seeing physical examples. I absolutely love it. Thank you very much. Okay. All right. Okay, guys, we come down that leg. Let's go a little further down, eh? Batteries. Positive energy. They have an interesting display. Wish I could talk to them more about their technology. Looks like they. Hi, how's it going? Hey, doing well. So, what we have here is the world's first battery operated retro video game arcade console. No way. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We're playing Frogger. Because if we have a line of people, we need a game where people are going to die quickly. What? <laughs> Frogger is one of those games where it's fun to play, easy to play, difficult to master. And it's playing off that battery bank down there? It is. Well, no. There's a, there are two batteries on the inside. Okay. Um, there are two uh, big... So these are... Everything here is, um, is rescue. Kind of like a rescue pet. Okay. It's a rescue wild card. Um, so the batteries in there are from a, UPS, from a UPS backup battery installation that I did about three years ago, and the batteries were uh, five years old. So they're eight-year-old batteries right. still kicking, right. and it's running right off batteries right now. Very um, cool. So it's a method of being green and recycling your, your already existing uh, technology. You're absolutely correct. Well, that's very absolutely cool. Correct. Because batteries, um, I know biomeds love to uh, follow you know, regulation and all of that. We love to have batteries swapped out every year, every two years. However, a lot of times, these battery chemistries are designed to last eight to 10 years. That's money we're right, throwing right. away. That's, that's uh, efficiency we're throwing away. And that's a lot of uh, uh, outside countries getting all the business on the lithium uh, cobalt mining and right, everything like right. that. And it's like, we're just feeding these countries, but we could just be re re reusing the existing batteries that we have and uh, analyzing them and making sure they're still good. So, anyway. Interesting. But, you Interesting. Know, that's a Do you have a, a business card that I can uh, show? Yes. Here. Go ahead and uh, pop it right down there on all. Well, yeah, all my information Oh, oh right excellent. Here. There we yes, go. Sir. I really like that. Man, I'll tell you, it definitely makes it easier. Okay. Yeah, it does. So it's david at pebattery.com. All right, good guys? Job. Top score. All Top right. score. We'll see, if we'll see if it stays. Thanks, man. Thank you. Hey, thanks a lot. Appreciate you. Okay. Next is MIT Labs. MIT Labs has a variety of stuff that they're working on. So ZRG, ZRG are some of the guys that uh, they do uh, use medical equipment out of California. ZRG has a presence at every one of these shows. They do a good show. Oh. You see, I'm still going. My arms are going to be so tired by the time I'm done, guys. I swear. So, Elite Biomed. How you doing, sir? <laughs> CM Parts Plus. 
Everybody's got a good representation out here. Integrity Biomedical Services. Hey, how y'all doing? FSI. Hey guys. FSI, they do uh, data. Oh, guys, look at this. How cool is this? Hey guys, how y'all doing? Zoll, of course, always comes out pretty strong. Love some of the new Zoll products. The Life Band, what is that? What's the Life Band? I've never seen that before. Oh, uh, you've never seen this? No. So, imagine taking manual CPR to the next level. Okay. This is gonna be automated, so no more having to do anything with your hands. Like what? Okay. You start the device, sizes up the patient for size, shape, and rigidity of the chest. Okay. Automatic compression and chest compression. Oh, wow. Okay, let's see what the display says. So pretty much what it does, it does your, keeps your compression fraction higher, meaning hands okay. on the chest at all times. And it works just like a human being would, except more efficiently. Wow. That's so cool. Automatically stops, allowing you to give two ventilations. Right. And then it resumes. No nice. No more having to change uh, caretakers to do chest compression. Very cool. Wow. All right. Well, that's definitely something new. I've never seen that before. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Thank you. Zola. Hey, guys. GE, of course. GE is one of the foundations for medical equipment. Oh, that's cool. I don't think I've seen that guy before. I love the carrying hand. What's that model? What is that called? Tearscape 1. Tearscape? Okay. It's I've never seen one person. Yeah, it's yeah. a brand new transport model. Okay. Wow. Built-in handle. I, I don't, you know, maybe it's because I always work for hospitals that had old stuff, you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just, well, that's this is so brand cool. new. So, brand new. Like a year, year and a half. Oh, like that. this is that one that's got the universal ports. Correct. Right. Great USBs. I have heard of this guy. I think the only problem that people have ever had with it is that the cables are expensive. Which, I mean, it's going to be, but... Yeah, I mean, we have cool service offerings that help with that. Too. Oh, yeah? yeah? And it provides you flexibility, so you can flex. You just buy the, the Carescape 1, you can have a low acuity area, and you can make it put that in the ICU just by giving it care. Right, right, right. So it makes it... So it automatically easy. recognizes the cable that's plugged in the port. Recognizes it. Uh, you can put, you know, if you need more invasive, so you don't have to order the monitor with two invasive, right. one invasive. You can order it with that and just buy the cable. So you so can slot you really that straight in that ICU. Yeah. And it's a transport monitor too. Yeah. Very cool. Now what model is this guy? Uh, That's the V650. Oh, the V650. All right. So this is, yeah, right, right. so that's what I'm, That's what I'm used to. Yeah, so essentially this would go away and then this would be mounted underneath. So when, okay. you, when your patient, you know, we wouldn't have this, your patient would be hooked up to this, this is plugged into here, and when you have to transport it, you just take this. Just grab it and go. Yeah, and then when you come back, you just plug this well, back in. That's very interesting. Okay. Yeah. Crop tested, water rated. Okay. Very, very durable, built-in DMO, which is really nice. Changeable batteries. Lithium ion, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Wow. I mean, this will run. Oh, cool! So it's got a communications pack around the back, so that you can oh, hook so it yeah, up to a network. What, if this was mounted underneath here, that's what we slide in and out, right? So right. That, that would actually be what charges. Oh, I got you. Yeah, yeah. I so got you. So you mounted on the wall. You root. I get it. Interesting. Well, maybe someday I'll see one in a live facility. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Oh, GE ultrasound. You guys know. I dig ultrasound, man. I wish I did more videos of that. But look at look at this guy. Look at the package there. Very cool. 
Ultrasounds are just getting smaller and more portable. And I, I love ultrasound. It's one of the fastest growing technologies out there. Multimedics, look at this. These guys repair ultrasound probes. Good stuff. Oh, getting a, oh, look at these guys. They got one of their new tables set up. And, whoop, they've got one of their new lights. I have not seen this one before. Well, that's interesting. Let's see what the stand looks like. So, what's the what's the runtime on this uh, battery powered light? So for the battery powered light, um, I think it's like twelve hours. Okay. But you know, you know, for a mobile, but we uh, typically, you know, you don't want to use a mobile in a, in a clinical situation. Right. But I have had surgical lights go out in the middle of, yes. of the case, and Absolutely. that would be an awesome, awesome. I like how the, the legs fold up. I don't yeah, know if no, you guys it's see. Very, it's very robust. So it, you can see how the legs fold up right there? It doesn't, it doesn't move. It stays in place, which you right. typically don't get out of a moment. I wanted to see the control panel. You can see that it's got a touch panel on it, it looks like. Very cool. All right. Very cool. Thanks, man. No problem. Thank you. Hey, Jay. Uh, yeah, I am. I am uh, going through. You filming the execution table? <laughs> <laughs> IMT Analytics. Now, uh, you guys seen in another video? I said that that one right there is new. It's got the same display as the little uh, K7. Very cool stuff going on there. Uh, BD Arctic. That's actually a cool one. Temperature management. That's a new one I've never seen before. Very cool. What? What is this? What is this? All right. This is a change. Uh, is that a slush maker? That is not. That's an irrigation canoe. Okay. But I have never seen one like this. Yeah, this, is, is our, this is our newest, uh, our newest offering, basically. So it actually, look at this guy. It's got foot pedals. It's height adjustable. What? Do you guys see that? It actually calculates the uh, amount of food you use for a case. No kidding. It's an upgrade from our... Right, right. I mean, the other ones are the standard. Yeah, the other so, one is the metal. Look you know, at this. It tells you to install a drape. It knows if you've installed a drape. That's so cool. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. <laughs> you don't have a little bag for all the goodies in? Uh, no, uh, you can go and get a bag. Here. I don't have a badge. They're looking at no, me. No, here. no, no. Here, you want? Here, take my badge. I think everybody here, here has a badge. Take mine. This is Justin. Everybody knows me. So Avante, let me tell you something about Avante. These guys always go over. Avante is the standard. Look at this. Hi guys, how you doing? <laughs> so these guys always set up this booth and the booth always has a private area and uh, you can go in, you can have, you know, a good business meeting stuff. I always dig this, man. Must be a pain and expensive to take around, but it is what it is. And of course, take a look. We got Tech Nation going on here. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> MedWrench, right next door. And guys, here's the crazy thing. You know, these guys are handing out drink tokens and right there's the bar. Yeah, tell me you're a drinker without telling me you're a drinker. <laughs> So you guys know MedRanch. I'm on there. I answer questions on there. I always have some cool stuff. All right. I'll look weird with Justin. Oh, you are. All right. Medical cables. Global medical cables.
All right. They offer a variety of different cables, guys. A variety of different cables. Oh, look at this. Amy? Of course, Amy's going to make a show. Hey, how you doing? Fine. Can I ask what you're filming for? I have a YouTube channel where I talk about medical technology and yeah, yeah. I talk about professional development. I talk about technical things, physiology, anatomy, everything. Gotcha. Absolutely everything. Gotcha. So this would be my eighth or ninth show this year. Something like that. Gotcha. So, Good luck. Thank you. It's been well. Steris. That was a little awkward maybe from Amy. Steris has some cool stuff. I wonder what that is. What the heck is that? That is interesting. All right, maybe I'll get some more info on that later. Okay, guys? Of course, Steris. Industry standard. Hey, how's it going, man? <laughs> look at you. You're you're just a bad habit on everybody. Oh, look at this. Here's the V Pro S2. So this is a plasma sterilizer. Take a look at it. I've always loved working on stair stuff, man. So, hey guys. New pipettes. Evolve. Hey ladies, how's it going? Evolve. You can see they do cables. What? Pi Cube. Oh, I was going to come over and talk to you guys at Pi Cube. Hey, how's it going? So, Pi Cube does uh, a variety of different things. Uh, they do asset management, and, uh, you know, I, I was going to try and compare some of these systems uh, because this is the future. And I wanted to show you guys that this is the direction that everybody is going, you know, because we can, we can actually. Uh, keep track of our, our devices much better with uh, some of these new techs. Thanks, ladies. Here, can you hold that? Thanks. <laughs> All right, so. Uh, Nihon Koden. So, Nihon Koden, they don't have a huge market share in the United States, but they're getting better. And I think that they have some very innovative products and I'd love to cover more of their products because, you know, when I see things that are really original, oh, take a look at that. So I've covered some of their patient monitors before and you guys know uh, at another show, I've covered this, which is actually a control panel for the ventilator right here. So it's an identical display for the control panel and it's one umbilical cord that connects both of them. So you can control everything from outside the patient's room. What a fantastic technology. I bet you a lot of people wish they had that a couple years ago. So anyway, that's Neon Coden. All right, thanks guys. Althea, take a look at this. Hey Jay, go ahead, grab, grab, grab you. Sure, sure. Absolutely. Hey guys, how y'all doing? How are you, Justin? <laughs> so Althea, you guys know that these guys specialize in imaging. But did you also know that they do depot repair and other things? Because they do. All right. Thanks guys. See. Oh. Guys, I think I'm missing something. Okay, A plus medical. A plus medical. Hey man, how's it going? A plus medical. So I, I knew I missed uh, this 
this area down here. Yeah, yeah. So where are you guys based out of? We're based out of Rock Hill, South Carolina. Okay. Uh, we do imaging parts sales, uh, refurbished, used, uh, anything from your major manufacturers, GE Phillips, to kind of some of the more quirky stuff. You're over Bennett Rooms, uh, Quantum, and anything in between. Interesting, because uh, I actually was a biomed in South Carolina for like six or seven years. And uh, I, I don't know if I've ever used you guys. Is it, are yeah, you? we're based on uh, originally Rock Hill. Uh, we moved okay. to Fort Mill. We so moved you guys to Charlotte. Are more, right. I'm bouncing all around that like 15, okay. 20 mile space. Well, man, I'm glad that y'all made it down here. Absolutely. Yeah. Thanks, man. Appreciate your time. Hello. How you doing? Med service. <laughs> Med service always has some cool stuff. <laughs> some people get really camera shy. They, they, they really do. <laughs> well, you're busted now, so it don't matter. Hey, man, how's it going? So, at, as I said before, this is going to be a standard. So, all the biomeds that stand off and they say that we're separating ourselves from IT, no, no, no. If anything, we're going to be way more integrated in the near future. And if you guys have ever used one of these systems to uh, track your equipment, see what's actually touching the network, you'll find out there's no going back. Once you do it, there's no going back. The visibility you never had before. Absolutely. Once you can see everything on the network, the CISO gets excited, the supply chain gets excited, right. and Biomed gets to be the hero. Right. For budgetary reasons, for recall reasons, there's yep. many reasons to want to know what's touching your network. So, there you guys go. That's a simile. Thanks, man. Appreciate your time. All right, so you guys know Navolo. You guys know I did a video on Lexicon and it was awesome. Look at this. You got Crothel. Here we have RSTI. Alpha source, wow. Hey, how y'all doing? Oh, you guys know I'm fond of the M Milwaukee sets. So Alpha source used to be where we would get all our parts from. And uh, Obviously that changes with your hospital, but there are some of these companies that I've done business with for years. So, here we have Link Medical. PIMS, EQ2, CMMS. Oh, you guys know I love CMMS systems. Competition's good, guys. Competition's good. Mindray. Check out Mindray. So here is a company and some products that I have almost never seen in the field because I've usually been at Philips or GE type hospitals. But Mindray has some interesting things, man. Some interesting things. Oh, look at that little vital signs monitor right there. Maybe I'll be able to do a video on it sometime soon, okay? Excuse me, guys. All, all parts medical. <laughs> Medical Imaging Solutions. Oh, let's check that out. Sorry. Check that little guy out right there. Cool little patient monitor, along with this one right here. Look at those. What? What? <laughs> I tell you what, I think my heart skipped a beat when you dropped it, man. <laughs> Wow, that's so incredible. Look at that, look at that high resolution display. That's absolutely amazing. Well, that's very cool. It's almost nurse proof. <laughs> so that's a carrying handle. That's a carrying handle, it's not a full model. That's a carrying handle with some attachments. Very cool. 
Very, very cool. MIS, Medical Imaging Solutions. Hatchich, I've heard of these guys. Hatchich. How y'all doing? I'm doing really good. Oh, hi. Gem Therm. Ooh, what is this guy? Astropad. That's interesting. Get this one on there because they all know this one. The blanket trawl. That's a standard. That's industry standard. It is. German Electronics. They sell parts for whatever your German medical equipment is, for sure. What? Trace Logics. They are a depot. BMES. Patient monitoring specialties. <laughs> Hello. How you doing? No, I was saying that I see a lot of your videos. You do? I really do. Oh, yeah, thank yeah. you. And I appreciate like the, you know, like well, the, 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 the passion for the field is an inspiration. Oh, thank you. you know? it's, it is a lot of work, but no, uh, I, 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 I do meet some cool people though. No, but it, I see, like I said, I see a lot of your videos, you know, and it's, um, you well, know, I appreciate that. I know it's a lot you. of hard work. I, you know, so, some days I, I wonder. Oh my goodness. Yeah. So cute. yeah. My daughter just wants to be in all my videos. That she really awesome. does. That is awesome. She is just the cutest. So. Well, well, thank you well, so we much. Know, but we appreciate, you know. Well, I, feel I free. I to a lot of folks at where we're at. Yeah? Yeah. Well, if you guys ever think of something that uh, you want me to cover more of, let me know. Okay. okay. And I certainly try to. Uh, yeah, and I'm going to tell them to subscribe. I don't even think I, because I started watching them, but, you know, I'll tell them and then, yeah. Well, thank you so very much. Thank I appreciate so much. the kind words. All right. Hey. Thank you, guys. Yeah. Have a good day. Good Same day. to you. So, Dexo. What's that? I don't know. Let's, let's, let's go. Ch yeah, go grab one. Go ahead. Go ahead. Grab one. So, Dexo, of course. Always has an interesting booth. Here, go ahead. How's it going, man? How you doing? Innovative. You guys know I've covered some of their products before. On YouTube? Yeah, you know I, I did a video where I tore open you guys' uh, the, the little thing. Yep. First I, I did the full length video and I showed them, because uh, I think it's a really cool technology. And then I did a whole nother video where I showed them how it works and what it does. I've seen the first one. I don't know that I've seen that. Yeah, follow yeah. I, I did a second video uh, because I've had people that wanted to argue with me over how it starts playing when the door opens. And uh, I. What are you talking about? One of these? No, no. That guy right there. Oh, this guy. Yeah, that oh, one. I didn't see that then. Okay. Yeah. So that's that. Honestly, these are pretty cool, aren't they? That is one of the coolest things I've ever seen at a trade show, man. Yeah. And the thing is, like, we, we limit their how easily we give these away. These weren't cheap. I I can imagine. I can imagine. That's why I played it full length, you know, on a, on a video because I wanted people to see the message. But at the same time, I wanted to you know solve the the how it works. So I did one video where I opened it up and showed that it was a. I have to go because I've seen a number of your videos. Yeah. I mean, you've got a lot. Yeah, I do. <laughs> but I, I really have to go look at that one because I missed that one altogether. Yeah, man. That's, I had somebody who wanted to argue with me over how it works, and I'm like, okay, let's get to the bottom of this. And uh, I did it proper where we did a proper Battery teardown. Battery life is real bad. I actually have. Do you? So I have the, a couple of charging over here. Really well, man, I, I did it. portable charger just ready to go whenever. I'd like to think I did it justice because uh, whenever I see something cool and original, I want to I want to cover it, man. Setting the standard. Thank you. Great show. That's a nice uh, setup. You <laughs> Thanks. So, guys, here's USOC. They always have a very interesting booth. Uh, very big booth, always. So, hey, how y'all doing? 
Yeah, go ahead. So USOC, they just got bought out by a Houston investment group and they're expanding like very quickly, very quickly. So uh, you guys know USOC, they always make a presence just like the guys over at Avante. Thanks guys. Okay, before my arms give out, because this setup is kind of, it is kind of heavy. Let's come on up here. And look at the show that Drager has put on. Look at this. How cool is this? I seen the crates coming in and Drager unloaded so much cool stuff. Oh my gosh, check this out. You guys know a lot of incubators are just old, weathered, tired, brittle. But Drager has brought their whole new unit to the show. How cool is that? It's beautiful. Hate to see it when a nurse gets a hold of it. <laughs> It's so beautiful. Drager, you know, I've, I've been a fan of their uh, respiratory products for a while, but look at this. Infant incubator. How cool. You can see, here's their ventilator. Thanks for letting me into your booth, guys. Appreciate it. So cool. I love that incubator, man. It's beautiful. It is. It's kind of creepy. <laughs> <laughs> kind of creepy. I'm gonna. I'll tell you. <laughs> Exclusive medical. Hey guys, how y'all doing? Exclusive medical. They do field service, repair, system sales. You guys at Prescotts. Hey man, how are you? So Prescotts does replacement bulbs. They have rebuild kits for your Zeiss Zeiss microscopes. I've seen them. They're very cool. I'd uh, love to do a video on the kits because I think it's such an efficient way of uh, doing it at a, at a cost. Hey, Interstate, how y'all doing? doing? So everybody knows Interstate. They're, they're one of the standards for batteries. Oh, look at y'all. Look at it, they're giving away batteries. How cool. Well, you guys know that Interstate does like car batteries and stuff, but they also do medical grade batteries and they have a whole selection. Very cool, guys. So that's Interstate. Thanks, guys. Part Source. Hey, how y'all doing? So, Part Source is one of those companies I've been working with quite a bit. Uh, I actually handle a lot of their contracts and stuff. So if you guys didn't know who I'm always talking about when I'm working with contracts, it's always part source. So <laughs> I work with Phoebe and we handle a lot of the service line contracts for you guys. Yeah. So thank you very much for your time. AIV. So here's a company. I, I went and I exposed one of their products and I said it's one of the best in show. And here is that product live right here. And this is the one that I said was so cool because it's got the graphical representation right on the front panel that shows you your current loadout. It's got the new Hubble brand outlets. So they upgraded. Notice there's independent breakers for each side. And right here is a little current check. So you can QC your own scale that's on the front. Easy. And it's got a heavy duty cord. Come in 15 amp and 20 amp versions. Fantastic product. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. <laughs> yep. Man, I I'll tell you what. I I just had to give it uh, as best product when uh, as soon as I seen it. Yeah. Well, I I really dig it, man. I really think they need to be in every OR. Bypass vision parts. Oh, look at that. It's hard to get parts. Did you know that? It's hard to find these parts anyplace. And here they have them. I didn't know that. So that's AIV, guys. Okay, check this out. 
That's the e -Tech. Front and center booth. Hey, hey Jay, you can feel free to, to just walk up and grab whatever you want. It's, it, it, no, no, that's how trade shows work. So they do uh, medical equipment management and they do products and supplies and stuff. Very cool. Here is a company that I have not talked to yet. Hey, sir, how you doing? How are you? I'm doing really good. Now this is one company that I have not seen at a trade show, so I was really curious. Like, Schiller, uh, what what is your product line? What do you guys? Uh, um, so you do cardiographs. EKG machine. Okay. Spirometry. Okay. Monitors, alters, diagnostic station. Um, and also, uh, okay. Yeah, it's a cool. That's a nice display. Check that out, guys. We are by side. Rest in CD is spirometry. Okay. Rest in breathing is CD. All in one machine. Wow, all in one machine. Yeah. That is so cool. I've never seen one like that. Uh, Interesting. And, and connect the, the machine to your Wi-Fi. Yeah. For the print, the Wi-Fi printer. I transmit the record to the Wi-Fi oh. printer automatically. That's cool. Yeah. Oh, that's your spirometry module. It's okay. out of calibration. It doesn't need any calibration. And it's PC based. Connect the spirometry, the sensor to the computer. Okay. And this one is the software. Simple. Course spirometry. And you can get the oh, look at that. It's fantastic. Now this is one guy I wanted to get over and take a video. Yeah, this is the other EKG machine. I've never seen this one before. Yeah, it's similar to that one. Okay. But it has a, a bigger printer. Okay. Use the same screen, okay, and do the the friendly keyboard. Very cool. Mm -hmm. Thanks, man. I appreciate your time. You're welcome. Okay, guys, it's going to be a pretty large video, but this has been a pretty good overview of the show here today. And now I got to come back to Phoebe set my stuff down because my arms are shaking so bad. I hope the video is not shaking. But guys, there's going to be some big things coming in 2022. So stay tuned. We are going to do it very big. Coming up in April at MD Expo in Atlanta. We're gonna, we got some announcements to make. So that's uh, Phoebe Medical, guys. What a better way to, to end this, right? Anyway, guys. My arms are shaking so bad because this thing's kind of heavy. So I hope this video comes out good. And thank you very much for your time, okay?